everybody a boring old margarita because today to celebrate Cinco de Mayo, we are going to the extreme, revealing margaritas like you have never tasted before. It is something you should know, so please welcome author of Practically Posh, Robin Moreno. Hey, Robin, hey. welcome back. Hey. Good to see you. Happy Cinco de Mayo. Happy okay. Cinco de Mayo. Okay, so something that you guys should all know is that Americans drink twice as much tequila today on Cinco de Mayo than the rest of the year. Oh, really? So okay, so, like let's get started. Started. so let's get started. Yeah. So we're going to have a lot of fun. So first up, we have an orange and salted caramel margarita. So uh -huh. it's really nice. This is for someone that doesn't really like the tanginess, the tartness of a margarita. It's a little bit sweet, but delicious as well. Oh, that's good. It's, the orange goes with the caramel, right? Mm -hmm. Super, super fun. Getting nervous. Are okay. you getting crazy? It's good. It's good. Okay, so okay then, what's next? So we're actually putting a twist on a traditional frozen strawberry margarita. We actually infuse the tequila with jalapeno. So it has a really nice kick to it, a little heat. And the heat actually blends with the freshness of the strawberry. Wow. So really refreshing. And a fun way to wow your friends. Wow. That's a little hot. It's a little hot. It's fun. But I'm a little hot. You are so that's you're very hot. All right, so, so, let's, for you. so let's make one now. Okay, so this one is called the La Paloma. So this is actually not a margarita. So it's oh. made with grapefruit soda. And it is the most popular tequila cocktail drunk in all of Mexico, the okay. Paloma. We're we calling it the La because it has lavender. So first up, we start with tequila. We do an, about an ounce and a half of tequila. This one is Don't reposado. Don't bother to measure. Just keep I'm pouring. I'm just doing it. Okay. Right. I, know okay. you, I heard you like to drink. I do. We're going to top it off with then about a half ounce of a lime juice. Yum. There we go. Okay. And then we go about a half ounce of our grapefruit soda. Ooh, terrific. And then we have two dashes of lavender simple syrup, which is really easy to make. It's just water, sugar, and lavender. Oh. There we go. And then I'm going to stir it for you. Lovely. Ooh. And then we're going to top it off with a little ice and get my hands in there because we're such no, good go friends. Ahead. I don't mind at top all. Top it off with fresh lavender sprig. And then from garden to glass, you have a drink you can drink all summer long. It is fantastic. The recipes are on MeredithVRShow.com.